Today we're going to cook a little chicken breast and we're going to have rice with it along with some broccoli. Now the trick's going to be to add some flavoring to this chicken breast without any salt, any sugar, any oil. I'll show you how we do that. Okay, so I took a coffee cup and I added one heaping tablespoon of black pepper, one heaping tablespoon of garlic powder, not garlic, but garlic powder. Okay, I took nine teaspoons of lemon juice, mixed it together, okay? Then I took a sieve in another container and I poured my mixture into the sieve and it caught all the heavy uh, garlic powder and especially the black pepper and now what I've got left over is you know a somewhat somewhat thick sauce it's mostly lemon juice but it's 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 a little strong it's a little hot so we're gonna pour that into the uh, pot of boiling water which we're going to add the chicken to. I'm going to carefully add this chicken because it's frozen and the water's boiling so we don't want to have any accidents here. And we're only going to be able to add about half of the bag because we just don't have room for any more. So let's, you know, take some time to cook this meal. Okay, I'm going to add my broccoli, which I've got chopped up here, into the same water that I cooked my chicken in as you can see because this water has still got the flavoring in it and we want the broccoli to absorb that flavoring as well okay so I'm going to add my uh, my rice which I uh, cooked for one minute and then I let it stand for five minutes okay so I've uh, drained off my broccoli I'm going to pour that in to the bowl and then I'm going to Cut this up a little finer, okay? Now what I did, in order to make this a little moister, I took about a coffee cup and a half of the water that I had boiled the chicken and the broccoli in and added that to the mixture because, you know, that rice, it can be very dry. So. That and the, the moisture that's in the broccoli will now bring this dish to a perfect level of moistness. And with those, uh, with the black pepper and the garlic and the lemon juice, we have a very lightly seasoned dish now that I can eat and my dog can eat. It won't hurt my dog. So we have an extremely healthy dish here. As you can see, this is uh, enough now for a couple of days. And uh, enjoy. Okay, so as you can see, uh, this dish took took a while to you know to uh, prepare, and uh, so. You know, if you're really serious about bodybuilding, competitive bodybuilding, you're going to spend a lot of time in the kitchen. A lot more time than you spend in the gym because you're going to have to eat clean. If you want to be hard and cut, you're going to have to eat clean all day long. So, you know, I hope this uh, little video helped out. Uh, we're going to have many more to come uh, as we get closer to uh, summer. We're all going to want to eat cleaner and you know it's been it's been the off season and I haven't been eating clean but uh yeah we're gonna have some videos now that show you how to do that.